All right, guys, this is all great. This is fantastic. Today, we're going to learn about how we can change instead of having every single files to be ended with that handlebars. We want it to be ended with something totally different. Well, well, we can do that. First thing first, we need another something called XT, X, X, e, X, T name something. And then this is where we actually define what would be the name that we would like our files to have. For example, we want them to have something like probably my last name. How about that? Somebody see an entire language like with your name. How cool is this? Now, after you added this, uh, this property right here, you also need to come where wherever it's saying handleball. Like for example, here it's saying handleball. Then we're going to change it with whatever you change it to be, right? You have this, oops, I think it was that Aximi. There you go, something like this. So we got that Aximi as the last name right here as well. And then the other places we also want to change it is right here. And there we go, we change it to be this. Now, once again, we added this key, we change it this place here, and we also change it this place here as well. This is how we kind of define it to have whatever name we want our files to be ended. And now we can head over and change our name to be you know the same thing Aximi Sterling I can just copy actually just copy this one here and I'm gonna rename this one to be to do the same thing I'm gonna rename every single file and boom there we go and boom and I can do the same for this one as well there you go and I can go ahead and do the same for my partials and I can do the same for my partial here. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I just changed the entire everything with that axiom. And let's actually see if this works. Let me stop my server and run it again. And let's see if I refresh this, it should work. Oops, oh, something's messed up. Oh, yep, because I forgot to change the main with uh, axiom stolen. So everything else, uh, that's my layout. Cool. And now let's try to refresh this one here and serve it again. And there you go, guys, ladies and gentlemen, everything is working as expected. I can go back to here and there we go. Everything is working as expected. This is how you change your dot handleball files to be named something totally different. Once again, uh, in the next video, you will see me changes uh, uh, things back. Uh, we'll see if this is something actually right. Well, this is how you change your handleball dot files to be named something else.